Welcome to the gap. This is gap. They should have never gave you platforms. And good lord, man. You other groups. You buffer groups. All right. Man, y'all anti-blackness is getting out of control. I'm sick of it. You other groups, man. All right. And I know some of y'all is like, well, what you mean by the other groups? What, 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 what? Other groups like Myron Gaines, Sudanese, Sneeko, question mark. Every other month, he's something else. He Jamaican. He Haitian. He Creole. He Asian. He European. What are you, bruh? Other groups. Valentina Gomez. Keep talking, I'ma call ISIS. What? Toddy, your ass. Anti black. June Juneteenth is ghetto. Ma'am. Stop being a reject, Candace Owens. You see what happened to her. Pure silence. Kay Sanchez, Mexican lady, Republican out here, anti-black. What I mean from the anti-black, they going for our reparations, talk about we don't we don't deserve reparations. Or are they saying goofy stuff like, well, we immigrated to this country, so why should we have to pay? You only here because of us, because we fall for civil rights. Keep talking. We're going to civil right your ass back to your country. Oh Keep playing with God. us. Other goofy stuff they talking about. Our holidays and stuff is ghetto. Gomez. Your celebrations and Colombian celebrations. Do I need to say? I can't even post pictures on here. I'm going to get demonetized. Feathers and cheeks. But we ain't knocking y'all ish. But y'all knocking ours. Talk about it is ghetto. We be having cookouts and people come together and play spades. Which I ain't really good at. But play me in dominoes. I'll smack that ass. Yeah. We doing that. Uno. Stuff like that. You ain't having parades shaking booty cheeks, booty cheeks and feathers. You know, goddamn pigeons, because, you know, that's why it comes in New York. Even the pigeons be appalled, like, God damn. They misrepresenting us. Because they got feathers. And... Other, we other reckless, weak-ass, anti-blackness talking points. And this relies on, like, when Sneeko and Myron Gaines and the mother of them dweebs is getting intellectually ass-kicked by Tariq Nasheed, you feel me? They got this new term, Jewish supremacy. What? Y'all don't stop. It's like y'all took the term woke and remixed that. Now y'all got this Jewish supremacy. No, it's white supremacy. Okay. Falls under under the same umbrella, man. God, man, that's how we. Y'all just intellectually stupid, man. God damn. Any ask you, Tyreek be asked a simple question during that debate. So what about the the white Jewish people? You know, what I mean, that's uh, subjugating the black Jewish people. What do you call that? Myra Grains and Sneeko sounded like, you know, the, the, the character from Thornsbury. Don't know. Ah, 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 ah. I'm like, yeah. Cat got your tongue. You can't say nothing because it don't make sense. Don't, don't, no. Don't exist. Jewish supremacy don't exist. It's white supremacy. It fall under the same umbrella. Why break up? Why are we breaking up the group? We ain't going to do that. Then I have a question for Myron Gaines and Snagatooth. Jesus Christ. Yeah. That's your that's your new name, Sneeko. Your name's Snagatooth for now on. 
bruh, what are y'all doing to combat Jewish supremacy? What y'all, what y'all doing? Besides just saying it. Yeah. Pure idiots. Idiotic. And this is another thing. Look, I was talking to my lady earlier in the morning. We was kind of talking about this. And it sparked my brain to think of this. Like, it, And I said this also like earlier when, um, like a couple months ago. They do this as a grift in my opinion. Remember Just Pearly Things? Ain't heard from her in a while. Maybe her and Candace Owens is playing patty cake somewhere. I don't know. I ain't heard from neither one of them. But remember Just Pearly Things? Go into the whole manosphere, red pill-ish. You feel me? But they try to go into kind of more of the black sector of it. That's what Fresh and Fit did, my. Myron Gaines, and I still can't remember the brother name. Is he supposed to be fresh? Wow. <laughs> okay. But you see, when they stuff start crumbling within that realm, you know what I mean? Just pearly things, fresh and fit. You can't, you can't give dating advice and give advice when you're not taking your own advice. Fresh. I know I take these these women out here. Cause you know he barely talking and he talking off. Man, they're gonna get you, man. They're gonna, they're gonna get you. They're gonna get you. And then the, you know, man, these single mothers out here. Look at bruh. Bruh made a woman a single mother and that single mother out to get his ass. The same advice he tried to give the other his uh, his own audience. Golly, <laughs> comical. Again, kicked off the of platforms. And when this happens. Because they be in this realm, and let's be real, when it comes to that realm, it it the it don't it, it gets stale, okay? It's not a it's not a lot of intellectual talking points after a while. So when that start crumbling, and also what Valentina Gomez is doing to build up her profile, they all go anti-black, right wing. Super, super, super conservative. They all do that. You know why? Because it does pay for a little while. It's their own form of cooning. That's why they call them tethers. Tethers is immigrant coons. Dead ass. Immigrant cooning. Tethering. They just go ultra anti-black, super, super right, wing conservative media. That's what they try to do. And they grift. And then they think they think it's easier than what it is. Then they find out they get smacked around intellectually, first of all. Then second of all, they they find out they uh the the uh people that's running them right wing conservative media outlets and stuff. Really don't mess with y'all like that. Y'all like the mascot of white supremacy. Shout out to Tariq for that that statement. Because that's what they really is. The mascot work harder than, than the uh, team when it's, ha- when it's uh, on timeouts and stuff. You feel what I'm saying? Ain't nobody paying attention. They still over here. Dance for white supremacy. Yeah! What about black on black crime? Juneteenth ghetto. Oh my god. What about unemployment? What about abortion? You start thinking like, wait a minute, what this got to do with this ain't got nothing to do with black issue. <laughs> like golly. Y'all just start throwing stuff out there. And this the thing that's a doozy. Them alleged white supremacists be making fun of y'all. In front of y'all face. Myron, Myron Gaines is so much brown nosing for white approval. He don't even know he put up. They put up some tweets to talk about these, these African people washing their head with cow piss. Whatever it was. 
And that was in Sudan. Bro, Sudanese. Ain't this about it? Wow. See, that's what I mean. They, they, they have no intellect at all. You feel me? Golly. How, none. Zilch. You feel me? That's why within that that red pill manosphere stuff, it's only a couple of intellectual points when they come come do it. After a while, just bro, it's nothing. It's nothing smart coming out of there. It's easy combo. Yeah, you yeah you could build your numbers up, Dwee, by having OnlyFans models and goddamn porn stars, and y'all just trying to y'all trying to uh, intellectually dominate them. Of a stupid combo. Yeah, that's... Yeah! Easy! Easy work when you're using gimmicks. But you come in this room, you can't use no gimmicks, bro. And you're gonna get your... You're gonna get your ass intellectually spanked every time. Every time. And it baffles me, y'all. Y'all so anti-black, worrying about us, the white supremacists, Slapping you around in, in, uh, under closed doors. Bitch slapping y'all. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Who is your daddy? You are the good. You my daddy. <laughs> Black person just come walk around. It's like, dang, that's messed up. They come around. <laughs> hey, F you. You black mother effer. God damn! You done harm to me. I can't see you shine. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, man! Y'all, y'all, some man, bro. And see, that's the thing. I ain't talk about all immigrants. I talk about tethers. I talk about the the immigrants, these other groups that's undermining us as Black Americans. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Man. Y'all. Man. And that's why we don't listen to y'all anyway. Why would you listen to losers? If you're trying to win, would you listen to a loser that continues the losing plan? Y'all flee from y'all country. Come over to us. You feel me? And then tell us how we should do what y'all did. That means we'll be fleeing our country. And then working, most of y'all be working jobs that, such as Uber and Postmates and shit. Come on now. Like, <laughs> you want us to do that? You want us to do that in, in, in Africa? You want, in Colombia? Caribbean? You want us to do that there? No. Why would we go to a place y'all running from? Y'all remember, y'all seen that one video? When that African was running through the jungle, and then some uh, other, uh, some, some other African tribe, they was all white and jumped out. Wah! And bro was like, oh my God! Oh! Oh no! I gotta go! No, they got no, they got no! Oh, I'm gonna eat me! Y'all want us to cut. Y'all want us to listen to what y'all gotta say about what we doing in this country when y'all running like that from your own country. <laughs>